I am living with notes. I had vocal nodes. I'm a professional singer and last year I had vocal fo fold nodules. If you don't know what they are, basically they're like calluses a guitarist will get on their fingers. Now I'm recording this because last year I was terrified. I have been a professional full-time musician for seven years and I thought I'd lost my career. I went to YouTube and found so little on this topic so I thought I may be able to help someone else in this situation. If you have vocal nodules or are worried you do, I'm hoping I can help you either get rid of them or avoid getting them in the first place. So, uh, so what do they look like? Well, um, <laughs> this image looks a little gross, but I can show you. Um, this is an image taken when I had a nasal endoscopy, which is basically a camera down the throat. You can see on the badly uh, circled red bits, you can see uh, little white bits, and basically they're they're on my uh, um, they're on my vocal cords. My vocal cords, basically, I mean for for everyone, they they hit together, they uh, they vibrate, and and um, and they were hitting. Basically, they were hitting each other too much uh, on the bottom point first, uh, and that's how they they would they you know you want them like that, and they were doing that, and they were hitting too hard there, and they built up calluses. What did it feel like to have vocal nodules? In my experience, I felt just so vocally dry. Like I would sing for twenty seconds, and I'd need water, and I couldn't because I play guitar and sing and there's no real way to stop you know stop us on and grab water no matter what I did I, I needed more water it was there was no fix in it so what did I sound like when I was singing with vocal nodules well I noticed that I so I can sing with rasp you know I can put it on or take it off you know um, but I, I was doing it un unintentionally, I couldn't, there were some, some time, not all the time, but it was when, when my voice got more tired, um, I noticed that, yeah, I would, that I, I'd, I'd unintentionally have vocal distortion, vocal fold distortion on, uh, which I, you know, I didn't want, not, you know, not every song needs that. Will I, will I do reach up my hand? Right, so how I got rid of it? Well, here we go. Vocal rest. New exercises. Lots of water. Basic, boring, he healthy living stuff. Unfortunately, there's no tablet. There's no easy, real fix. Uh... And I'm going to share with you everything that I did and everything I was taught by my singing teacher and I had a vocal therapist that helped me get free of them. And I, I want to share this with you and hope I can help you. So this is the first part of a little series of videos. There's loads more to come. Uh, just, yeah, I want to help you. Don't worry, it'll be all right. Hey, I really hope you enjoyed the video. If you did enjoy it, please don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the bell icon. And if you fancy, you can click the one on the screen. I'm sure you'll enjoy that too.